Hey everybody, we've been doing this a month now, you know the drill. Bernie? It was a busy and ultimately sad week at Toronto City Hall. Let's start with policy first. City councils are furious following a surprise announcement out of the HECO that the Alcohol and Gaming Commission of Ontario will no longer be enforcing a long list of conditions currently attached to liquor licenses across Toronto, such as noise, garbage, and overcrowding. Councillor Adam Vaughn said the HECO is essentially throwing neighbourhoods to the wolves. Councillor Gord Perk said now the city has to make it more difficult for everyone to get licenses. Councillor signed a letter asking the HECO to th rethink their position. On the election front, a mysterious ad attacking John Tory surfaced online. The ad used Olivia Chow talking points, which led to speculation that her team was behind it. Tory supporters put the blame on operative Warren Kinsella. While Chow's team acknowledged having seen the footage before, before it was released, they said it was produced by a supporter, not a staffer. Kinsella cheekily denied it, sort of. Meanwhile, after much anticipation, Mayor Rob Ford revealed two members of his campaign team. Ben Johnson, the former Canadian sprinter who was forced to give back a gold medal because of steroid use, and one of the Trailer Park Boys, who happens to host an online marijuana show. After Ford's announcement, his brother downplayed the duo's involvement in the campaign. Doug also unveiled four new Ford bobbleheads soon to go on sale, including a limited edition campaign doll. The Fords will be selling the toys to raise re-election money. Finally, sad news on Thursday, Jim Flaherty, Canada's former finance minister and a longtime family friend of the Fords, passed away in Ottawa. With a tearful Doug at his side, the mayor made an emotional statement at City Hall, he said, it is with deep sadness and a heavy heart that I say goodbye to a very special friend. We love you, Jim, and we'll miss you. That's all for this week. Have a great weekend.